The following contest is a tables match and is for the prestigious Worldwide Wrestling Intercontinental Championship. Welcome back to Halloween Havoc and we got the fight of all fights coming right at you and all the way to the ring representing the greatest of faction to ever step foot in wrestling period women children men boys goats geese it don't fucking matter it's the nwo because once you're nwo you're nwo for life and that's just too woo. it's harper freaking Torres in the house Hashtag a free a Gino trying to do what she has yet to accomplish in this saga between her and Alex Bishop and that's when the fucking championship tonight could be the night in a table match on Halloween Havoc. How that's hardwood baby get you so Some respect on it, P. Uh, WWE Universe. It's the best there is, the best there was, and the best there ever will be coming out of Canada. So saith Alex uh, Bishop, the P. WWE Intercontinental Champion. Toronto, Ontario, Canada. She is and she has had it for a good minute now. And every time Harper uh, Torres seems to have the upper hand, Alex Bishop always comes through in the big one well tonight's the biggest of them all because it's their final uh, battle it's a table match for the intercontinental championship halloween havoc i'm hardwood get some and here we go there is the Intercontinental Championship on your screen. We got fighter introduction. Taking it down to my man. Or not. We're going right at it. Ten minutes on the clock. And Bishop now kicking Torres in the gut. And lifting her up above her head. What strength by the Intercontinental Champion. As she drops her all the way uh, down. And a snap hair pulled down now and Torres is in trouble much like that classic match that they had the two out of three falls was an instant classic and if you missed it go check it out you want to check out this whole saga between these two I guarantee you that much as Bishop still in control now and there is a knockout blow to Torres now get a table and end this thing if you're the Intercontinental Champion and she's flying off the top rope with a cross body right on top of Torres and the only way you can win is throwing your opponent through a table and there's a swing and neck breaker and Torres has not been able to do anything anything at all and there's the walking power slam and Bishop is just staying on the attack. And now here comes Torres. What a reverse. And she blocked that one. And now Torres on the attack. And look out Bishop. What a suplex. By NWO's Harper Torres. Hashtag free Gino. As she is trying to get the Intercontinental Championship. Right here tonight on Halloween Havoc. And coming up next. Is the Tag Team Championships on the line the world undisputed tag team championships the greatest tag team to ever be formed in history the living legends defending against the altar and the militia you don't want to fucking miss that and you don't want to miss the end of this one and look at torres what a freaking spear as bishop went flying all the way off the ring down to the floor and now Bishop with a table and Torres knocks it out of her hands and throws her in the ring and Torres needs to get a table 
and she needs to end this, but she has the upper hand. Seven minutes, and there is the uh, flip-flop smash by Alex Bishop while Torres was in that turnbuckle, and she's face down on the mat, and Bishop had a table, changed her mind, and I don't know, she's going back to get it again. She doesn't seem to know what she wants to do as Torres now comes to her senses. And she tried to get the table and Bishop will not let her do that. And Bishop walking around the ring now. Enough with the patty cake, Alex Bishop. Get your ass in the ring with a table and finish this. And look at Torres. She kicked the table right into Bishop's face. That's what she gets for playing around. We got six minutes and 50 seconds on the clock. Table in the ring now. And here we go, Torres with a punch to the gut on Bishop. And now she has her, and there is the power slam. And Bishop's gonna kick her right in the face as Torres was trying to pick her up. Get her to her feet, and there it is. There's the sidewalk slam by Harper Torres. And that one stunned the champ. And now Torres looking to set this table up. And Bishop comes right behind with the clothesline from hell. Do not forget, coming up in just a bit, the Global Championship is on the line. The top cat head of the table, Denise Ashley, putting it on the line against the rookie. Another rookie she has to put in her place. And that's what Denise Ashley seems to be doing lately. And now Harper Torres with that flying forearm. And Bishop is up in the ropes. And Torres going to set up the table. And here we go. And Bishop now grabs Torres and swings her into the turnbuckle. And Torres fights out of it and reverses the move. And gives her a good old body splash. And down goes the champ. Torres picks her up by her hair and swings her onto the outside and Torres is flying out right behind her. And the crowd chanting, we want tables as they want to see a body go through a table. That's what they came to see. And look out, not that table, not the Spanish table. Look out, homies. They're coming for you again. And Alex Bishop now working on that leg of uh, Torres. That will eliminate some of that strength she'll need to get her through the table. And Bishop getting back into the ring now. And Bishop going to set up the table. And it's going to be waiting for Harper Torres. It's the same old story between these two. Harper Torres just cannot seem to beat Alex Bishop. That could be her kryptonite. And Bishop now picking up Torres by the hair. They're locking up. And Bishop sends her to the other side of the rope and brings her neck first onto that top rope. And now Bishop on the top. She's looking to fly. Waiting for Torres to get to her feet. Torres on her feet and a double axe hammer. Right on top of Torres. And now the sledgehammer. And Bishop is going to finish this. There is four minutes on the clock. We are down to four minutes. What a fucking fight. It's always a classic between these two. And now look at Torres Pedigree. Delivered to the champ on the outside on that hard mat floor. Dear God Almighty. And that could open up the door for Harper Torres. All she's got to do is walk through it. And you're the Intercontinental Champion. You've accomplished your goal. Instead... She sends Bishop on the other side of the rope and Bishop fights out of it. Punching Torres in the face and now Torres swinging Bishop up on the ropes and gives her the big a shoulder block. And here we go. Could it be? And Torres looking to put Bishop on the table. Harper to no! Bishop fighting back in the reverse elbows to the gun of Torres. I thought she had it. I thought she had it right there. And now Torres reversing the move. And here we go, a little ring around the rosy. And Torres with Bishop up and Torres taking Bishop down. And the crowd's starting to get a little bit behind Harper Torres. Hashtag free Gino and Torres now with Bishop on the table. Could it be? Will it be so? And Bishop fights out again. More ring around the rosy back and forth 
between Alex Bishop and Harper Torres. And now Torres, another reverse. And she's going to pick Bishop up for a power slam right on the table. Harper Torres has just won the Intercontinental Championship. Harper Torres has finally uh, done it. She's won the Intercontinental Championship. Congratulations on the first piece of gold in your career. Hashtag a free uh, Gino. Coming up next is uh, the tag team match for the World Undisputed Tag Team Championship. You do not want to miss it. It's Halloween Havoc. I'm Lance Hogwood. Don't go nowhere. We'll be right back. 